With everything happening in the world right now, wars, natural disasters, global chaos, you might be wondering, are we living in the end times? The Bible actually talks about this, and some of the signs it describes are eerily similar to what we're seeing today. In Matthew 24, Jesus gave us some clues about what to look for. He said we'd see wars and rumors of wars, nations rising against each other, and there would be famines and earthquakes all over the place. Does that sound familiar? It sure does. But Jesus said something really important after that, these are just the beginning of birth pains. In other words, they're a signal that bigger things are coming. Another big sign is the nation of Israel. Now, if you know your history, you'll remember that Israel became a nation again in 1948, which fulfilled the prophecy in Ezekiel 37. After almost 2,000 years, Israel is back in the land, just like the Bible said would happen. And ever since then, Israel's been at the center of world events, especially when it comes to tension in the Middle East. This is exactly what the Bible said would happen as we get closer to the end. Jesus also warned that there would be a lot of deception in the last days, people claiming to have the truth, false prophets, and all kinds of confusion. That's another thing we see all around us. But even with all of this, there's still hope. Jesus promised that he would return. In Matthew 24 verse 30, Jesus said, Then everyone will see the Son of Man coming on the clouds with power and great glory. It's a promise, he's coming back, and that's something we can hold on to no matter how crazy things get. So, the big question is, are you ready? The signs are all around us, but it's up to each of us to be prepared. Now is the time to dig deeper into the truth and get right with God. Let me know what you think in the comments. Do you see these signs happening today? And don't forget to subscribe for more discussions on faith, prophecy, and where we are in God's timeline.